Today we're going to make a wonderful sandwich. We're going to use some Swiss cheese, butter, and bread, turkey and ham, nutmeg, some cream, and eggs. I believe that's everything. Let's get started. Well, let's make some clarified butter. And I'm going to take two sticks of butter, which is mm, one cup. One cup of butter, and we're going to melt this over low heat. Well, it's been about a total time of 14, 13, 14 minutes. 13 or 14 minutes. It's, and it bubble, it's been bubbling for about oh, four minutes. I'm going to move it off the heat. And we're going to move it over here. And we're going to let this cool down for three minutes. Well, it's actually been about three and a half minutes. So I'm going to take a jar. This is like a, a mason jar, a canning jar. And put this here. And I'm going to put uh, some cheesecloth in a strainer. And we're going to strain this very carefully and slowly. And this will melt or go through the cheesecloth into our mason jar. And we will have about two thirds cup of wonderful clarified butter. Clarified butter is wonderful because it has much higher a smoking point than regular butter and plus adds wonderful flavor to your cooking. Next, we're going to take our three eggs. We're going to put in a half a teaspoon of the nutmeg, half a teaspoon nutmeg, and a cup of cream. Of course, you could use milk if you prefer. But you know it's better with cream. I'm going to get this all mixed up. This um, uh, solution is enough for two, three sandwiches, two or three. And you want to take your bread and put some uh, Swiss cheese on here. You know, don't be too, you know, put a decent amount on here. We're going to take our turkey. Use about four ounces of turkey and about four ounces of ham. Like that. Bring it together, and we're going to soak this bread in all of the. Uh, egg mixture here and get it really soaked on both sides very well longer than what I just did and take, take some of our clarified butter and put it in the pan to melt the pan's been heating up for just a little bit it's on low heat medium low heat And the sandwich has soaked about two minutes per side. And put this in our pan. And again, we're on low, medium, low heat. And we're going to let this uh, cook right there in the butter. It's been about two minutes. We're going to go ahead and check it because I can smell the egg cooking. I did cover it with that foil right away. Okay. Again, you want to be on low. Let's cook this for a little bit longer. It's been another four minutes. Let's check. 
check it out. It's looking very, very nice. I turn the stove down just a little bit more. We are on pretty low heat here, and this will do it. We're not gonna have to put this in the oven. Of course you could if you're in a hurry. Put this in the oven to help the uh, cheese melt. We're just gonna keep on going. We're gonna take about 10 minutes total to cook this. About 10 minutes and then keep covering it with this and it'll be just perfect. Let's look at this and check it out. Looking pretty nice. Mm. <laughs> very, very, very nice. Mm. Cheese is just oozing. Maybe it could have used a couple more minutes. You know, it cooked about 12. Man, it's so good though. You gotta try this and thank you so much for watching.